All right, so I only have about 15 minutes before I need to get over to the CSGO house, and uh, it is 11.15 Pacific time. I'm going to keep saying Pacific time until I'm like, normal time is Pacific time to me. <clears throat> you can see I'm wearing a CLG shirt. Uh, unfortunately, I asked for XLs, and apparently XLs are gigantic, so I need to... Uh, it's such a stupid, petty thing to ask for this early on, but to go back and be like, hey, yeah, I know I asked for XL, but can I swap to an L and get a large instead? Anyway, so what I've done so far today, um, myself and Mike, who is kind of like the team manager, handles a lot of the managerial stuff behind the scenes. He's the guy that was kind of filling in as a coach. You guys have probably seen him in the background uh, at the different LAN events that the team had gone to when, prior to having uh, a coach. Um, he uh, he gave me kind of a quick tour of the area last night, but then today when it was sunny out and it was bright, he took me to the store, um, went grocery shopping so that we, while we do have a team chef, it doesn't a lot of the things they prepare don't fit the diet that I'm on right now and, and the way that I'm eating. So I wanted to make sure that I'd have like a fallback plan in case, you know, whatever the meals of the day were, um, if I couldn't partake in those that I'd still be able to have, you know, the pro appropriate amounts of uh, nutritional value. And and so um, did that, went shopping, it's about 120 bucks. But you know, I got chicken, eggs, like super basic stuff that's really easy for me to cook if I need to and I'm in a pinch. And uh, I got a cup of coffee and what I'm doing right now is I'm trying to make sure that I can get uh, an Amazon order in for the things that I don't have or didn't remember or didn't know that I would need. For example, things like pillows that I realized last night I don't have. I would like to also get uh, like a small coffee maker that'll make, maybe not a Keurig because I kind of like the whole bean and I just think it makes better coffee, but like a small good coffee maker that, you know, hopefully is not more than like 40 bucks, 50 bucks if, I, if possible, I don't know if that's a thing. Um, a, a blender so that I can make protein shakes, protein powder. Um, these are these are things that as I'm saying them, I should be, <laughs> I should be here on Amazon adding them to my cart. So I'm actually going to do that. And uh, I'm not bringing the camera with me to the house today because I want to. I don't want to distract in any way from the qualifier that we've got in uh, three or four hours from now. Uh, so this will be kind of cut off by beginning of the day and then end of the day. There won't be any middle, at least at least not yet. I'll start to record a little bit more of the content with the guys, like at the house and that kind of thing, as I get a little bit more comfortable and as it, I feel like it's not distracting me or distracting them. So that's the plan. All right, so it is 8.30, which is 11.30 to me on East Coast time. And I am uh, just back to the staff house, my my room, my part of uh, this condo, whatever. And uh, I'm not, I'm not going to do a tour of the place right now. Maybe I'll do that tomorrow morning. I think I'm going to have maybe 15, 20 minutes of, of spare time. But we played in the qualifier today. We lost in a best of three against Rise Nation who's a good up-and-coming team, but it's a team that I feel like we should beat handedly. We did have a stand-in, and we can make all kinds of excuses, but uh, at the end of the day, we lost, and it sucked because I was really, really looking forward to, like, that would be, like, our first event. It would be super, super fun. But the good side of it, the, the positive and the, and the long-term good, long-term beneficial element of that loss is the fact that I got to witness a lot of the things that I know immediately we're going to be working on, things that we'll, we'll fix, things that need to be addressed. And, and I think that that's tremendously valuable because in my head I have already like five or ten things that I know when we fix them, it'll make us some percentage, some incremental percentage better, right? And if we're 5% better after this change and 3% better after that change, and like it, it, it should add up. So it sucks that we didn't have the result that we were hoping for. I was expecting to at least make it into the final and play Cloud9. The good news is I think we're going to come out better in the long term because of that loss. Uh, I, I also spent one-on-one uh, -on -one time with every single player except Kusta because he's obviously not here. And got a good feel of like where their heads are at, their goals, um, their strengths, weaknesses, what they feel like the team would benefit from. And, and just today was a great like foundation level type day. You know, it was... It was getting in on the, on the ground floor, truly being with the players. I didn't know the plays. I don't even know what some of their call outs were. And just like getting in there, talking to them, getting everybody on the same page and then outlining expectations and uh, and just kind of starting. So today was a really, really good day for that. It sucks that we didn't win the qualifier, but 
again, I, I think it, it's something that'll benefit us in the long term because there's so much great stuff for us to work on now. Being back at the, at the staff housing, what I'll probably do since it's so early, which is like, my body's telling me it's almost midnight and I know it's, it's only 8.40. Um, what I'm going to do, I'm going to type up some of my notes and, and get some of the reports and some of the like back office stuff type of stuff done, or at least, you know, make regular consistent progress on it. Uh, and then, oh, damn it, I forgot a mouse pad at the team house. Make some progress on that, get prepped for a little bit of the stuff that we'll be doing tomorrow. Uh, there's some, some practice things that I want to make sure that I've got, you know, kind of documented and at least thought out. And then I've got, there's a, there's just a lot of like back office type stuff, a lot of typing and writing of notes and those kinds of things that I'm going to make sure I get done and make progress on tonight. Uh, then I will probably watch Game of Thrones and probably go to bed. My pillows arrived. I have pillows now.